Westlawn Gardens. Where barrack style housing projects once stood, the new Westlawn Gardens offers an innovative model for healthy urban living. I lived in public housing for 30 years and uh, I'm going to tell you, from 30 years to now, we really flipped the script because of the simple fact Westline Gardens is gorgeous. We love it. It's 100% perfect and beautiful. Developed by the Housing Authority of the City of Milwaukee, West Lawn Gardens was supported by equity investment from PNC Real Estate, as well as $76 million in low-income housing tax credits from the Wisconsin Housing and Economic Development Authority, the largest such award in Wisconsin history. From 60th to 64th Street, from Silver Spring to Lincoln Creek, the first phase of West Lawn Gardens covers 37 acres. Residents helped design the kind of neighborhood they wanted to live in through a series of community meetings. The result includes 250 modern, affordable apartments and homes, green space, and 30,000 square feet of community gardens. West Lawn Gardens was the first development to receive the Stage 3 Lead Neighborhood Development Silver Certification under current standards, making it the world's highest rated example of smart growth, urbanism, and green building for neighborhoods. It is the first City of Milwaukee LED-lighted neighborhood, nearly cutting energy consumption in half. 1,200 square feet of prime land has been slated for neighborhood serving retail. Six city blocks have also been set aside for market rate homes, fostering a mixed income neighborhood environment. The project has forged new partnerships between residents and health, public safety, and educational groups. This has resulted in innovations such as the composting program, health awareness initiatives, job training opportunities, and an express vending library. You know, it takes the village to raise a child. In this case, we have now coined the, it takes the village to raise a village. So all the partners that are in this mix are the ones that are going to affect change, not only in terms of profound change, but also broad-based change that is uh, admired and appreciated and welcomed by uh, the broader community.